So guys, welcome back to Seven Kids and a Husband. My name is Lewis. This is my beautiful wife, Andrea. And this is our Morris Get Fit Weight Loss Journey Update number 10. Yeah. So, if you check number nine, it was been about two months in between number nine and number 10. And in those two months, we have not updated you guys one time. And that's simply because we started to suck on YouTube. Yeah, we was not so motivated. Not at all to do YouTube at all. Like, I don't know, maybe other YouTubers like you guys have that time where you just don't feel like doing shit. And the thing I noticed is that we do videos every... I'm not so comfortable here. Hello. We do videos every week like we're doing now. Like we do like three or four videos at once, batching. But if you skip one week, then the next week is easier to skip. Then skip and skip and skip. And it's sort of like going to the gym. If you mix miss one workout, it's not that bad of a deal. You miss two, okay, you kind of sucking. But once you get to two, you can miss three and four. And it's so easy to where you don't even think about it anymore. So we apologize for that. We are back. But we do have good news. In those two yeah. months, we didn't just sit on the sofa and just eat shit no. like nothing. No. I, in the last two months, I lost 15 pounds. And my wife has lost. So we have been doing work. We have been working out. I've been on it like crazy. I've been eating good. I do keto. I've been doing keto really, really good. I have had some slip ups, but I learned that you slip up, you get back up and you keep going. And that's what I've been doing really good. Like I have one binge night where it was cookies or something like that. And then I was right back to it the next day. And I also noticed that after a while of not doing those type of things, when I did have one of those slip ups, my stomach didn't feel good with that type of food. My head didn't feel good with that type of um, food. And I could tell the next day how tired and, um, just off I was because I wasn't, wasn't eating my normal healthy way of eating. Mm -hmm. So I minimized that to a really, really, like it doesn't really happen anymore. And I work out like every single day or at least six times a week where I go, if I have night shift, I go before night shift. If I have it, um, if I have late shift, I go after late shift. Like I work out either running or lifting weights every single day and maybe one day off each week. So I've been killing it and I am proud of myself and I'm just ready to keep going. Yeah. I went three times a week to the gym, which I got used to it, and swimming twice a week. So, yeah, five, di five days a week. Mm -hmm. I did some sports too, and I tried to eat healthy, which I'm not doing keto. I can't do it. I just try and do healthy food, like a lot of vegetables and fruits, and yeah. I try to avoid sugar still. So yeah, minus 11. It's not that much in two months, but... No, no, no. See, that's what I was thinking about. Not to cut you off. I'm sorry for that. So don't say, oh, he's so mean. He just cut her off. He's an asshole. I'm, I apologize. But I want to cut you off because of, um, when you read about keto, it's all these people like, oh my God, I lost 76 pounds in 22 hours and I lost 25 pounds in two days, like all this shit. And I'm losing like a pound and a half to two pounds a week. And I'm like, what the hell am I doing wrong? But then I think about it. Two pounds turns into four pounds. Four pounds turns into eight. The eight is to 16. And before you know it, it's six months down the road and you done lost 60 pounds. And I personally think it's much better to lose the weight slowly yeah. than to lose it quickly. And one thing that I, this is my theory. The people who lose like 100 pounds in six months, of which I have seen that on the keto. Oh my God, keto saved my life. 100 pounds in six months. Yeah. They starving the fuck out they self. And I refuse to go from one way of unhealthy eating to another way of, of unhealthy eating. Mm. And when they starve on themselves, they lose their muscle and they end up looking skinny fat. I've never seen not one transformation have I seen from a, from a person that's like, I lost 200 pounds in 12 months. And I'm like, that's the kind of body I want. No, it always looks... Not trained. It, exactly. It looks like a skinnier version of the fat person and it's still like a fat skinny person and that's not what i want to do i don't want to lose weight it just I, looked like a balloon you let some air out exactly i don't want to lose weight i want to lose fat and i think starving yourself is not the first thing to go is muscle and i don't want to lose muscle and that's what it is so 11 pounds in two months that's great because think about it in 12 months that's what you so that's less so that's six months in 12 months that's 72 pounds that's your that's like more the more than you go yeah and that's you slowly and you lose it and you're not losing any of your muscle, any of your curves, any of your butt, any of your breasts. Like none of that stuff is, which will be the first one for all the females that are like starving themselves. Yeah. So no, it's my good. butt's still there. <laughs> I know. So just keep going. My forehead is big as shit. Yup. 
Always been. That yeah. has nothing to do with keto. Can I lose weight on your forehead? It won't shrink. <laughs> All right, but that was our update for the past two months. Just know that we have not, even though you haven't seen us, we still have been going hard and we still will go hard. And now I know I said it last in the last video, but we will start updating at least every other week. She want to do every week, but I don't want to do every week because to sit here, we don't have that much to say over one week. Yeah. So let's do it every two weeks. We will be, we will be back on the sofa telling you guys what we did. But until then, you guys can comment down below and let us know how you've been doing over the past two months. Yeah, I've been watching some of you guys lately. I don't even uh, leave a lot of comments, but I'm watching you guys. And I'm there's, not. I do. I'm not. And there's a few I'm girls. Sorry, I'm not. I am so proud of you, ladies. I'm about to put her out. Who? I am so proud of you. For <laughs> Who? example, Who? I'm about Nina. To Who is Nina? She's a very big motivation to me. She lost a lot of I weight. I thought you were going to say a very big woman. I'm so sorry. No. Who is, who is Nina? Um, I follow her on YouTube and I follow her on Instagram. It's called No Filter Nina. Okay. And, and she lost a lot of weight. And she's not one of these people who shrink like a balloon. Mm -hmm. She training. Mm -hmm. And she actually started to transform into a very, 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 very... Fucking flies, man. Sexy we, body. We live in a country and there's always flies. It's not that we got shit in our houses. I'm just like, we live next to farms covered in shit and there's flies everywhere. It's fucking crazy. I hate that. Also, mom of four, for example. Mm -hmm. I don't know her. But okay. um, she going ham in the gym. I'm watching you girls. Well, you ladies should comment below and let us know what you're doing. And if anybody else, because there's some other people that were commenting two months ago about how they wanted to lose weight. Let us know. Did you give up? Are you still going? Let us know. Because we are back and we all can motivate each other. Hope you guys enjoyed this weight loss video update. If you did, leave a like. Leave a comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe. And until two we weeks. We deserve your like. Leave it. Yeah. Leave give us, us some like. likes. It helps us. And then until two weeks. Peace out. Mm -hmm.